You've got Didi uh, having its Wall Street debut. This is the Chinese ride-sharing giant Didi, set to be one of the largest IPOs of the year, aiming for a $60 billion valuation. It's going to get priced tonight. It's going to start trading tomorrow. Would you buy it? If you look at Uber and if you look at Lyft, they make no money, Maria. So, you know, we may see they were a little bit profitable last quarter. They had like $800 million, but that was from other investments. It wasn't actually from you know, the ride sharing that they do. And then they also have these food deliveries as well, which I think with COVID winding down, that doesn't look great either. So I think you have to be really careful when you look at these companies, because the other problem they have is just like in the U.S., they're also facing uh, anti-competitive practices. In fact, you know, Uber went head to head with them in China and ended up just giving up the business there because they're just losing money trying to compete. Um, and they've taken out a lot of their smaller competitors. So they also have the independent contractor issue. You know, all their drivers right now are not employees, just like in the U.S. That could be an issue down the line. So I would be skeptical of this IPO here and ride, you know, these ride uh, apps in general. I think they're they're definitely not the best place to be. There's just too many headwinds. And I like profitability personally.